Hello once again and welcome to Wonder Beer Wonder. I'm Scott. Still um, waiting for the return of um, the Beer Wonder. Seems to be going on forever. Um, been doing some Brewdog beers lately. I did the Brewdog um, rebranding, um, or rebadging, whatever you want to call it, the other day. Um, <coughs> had a look at Duopolis, um, which should come out sort of, probably come out before this. I don't know, I don't know what style I'm going to re release them in. Um, had a look at the, I think it's the rebadged um, Indie Pale Ale, so it's called, just called Brew Dogs Pale Ale or West Coast Classic. It's not a classic, it's fucking terrible. Um, and then was in um, was in Tesco's and picked up an old style can, uh, and it's the alcohol free version of Hazy Jane, and it's hazy, alcohol free. Now, the new cans. What I quite liked about <laughs> Brew Dog, some of the beers are fucking terrible, but I like the blurb on the side where they talk their little stories. This, so this one, the new cans don't have that, it's just um, mainstream packaging, um, so they've lost the identity of that. This one has got the old style packaging, so it's got a bit of blurb on it, and it says no alcohol, just got ju uh, no, uh, no alcohol, just got juiced up, and hazy alcohol free it's full on tilt fruit fruit machine all the attitude all the flavor but none of the alcohol well 0.5 percent um say hello to the juiciest alcohol free beer in town tropical fruits grassy notes mix it up oats and wheat unite for a smoother ride full flavor no alcohol all out new england hazy alcohol free the crushable crush so it's got um, oats and wheat in it, so I'm expecting at least to have some sort of body to it. Um, what have we done on here? We've done punk, alcohol free, and nanny state. Didn't like nanny state. Um, punk was better, but still nowhere near where it should be, or it could be. Um, so let's get this one out. I'm interested to see what it's like. Also, in the new range um, of the re branded rebadged badged range um hazy jane's dropped from 440 mil cans down into 330 cans and it's gone from 7.2 abv down to 5 abv um so they've lost almost a third of its abv looking forward to trying that out match it up against the other one um and we'll see what we get because hazy jane as a supermarket beer from Brewdog was probably one of their better ones so for them to have messed around with it that much disappoints me and worries me so let's have a look at this one and see what we get So in the glass, it's actually, actually got some haze to it. Um, a bit of carbonation rolling up as well on a very, very spacious white head. Um, it's coming away quite quickly. So it looks cordial, shall we say. So let's have a sniff. Um, you're getting some tropical notes. Are oh, they pretty hops in it? It doesn't say. It smells all right. This looks like you're getting some some um, pineapple, grapefruit, a um, little bit of orange. It's, it, it smells okay. So it, it, it's it's the right end of of um, hazy. So it's in the right direction. So, right, was right. Let's um, let's go in for the kill. Light flavours of um, of the tropical, like a bit of 
of orange, grapefruit, pineapple, um, those sort of standard fares for New England IPAs. Um, body. There isn't one. Um, even though they're saying there's got oats in it, it doesn't flesh the body out. Um, it's basically The aroma promised a little bit. The, the aroma promised a little bit um, with uh, the, the flavours that could be in there. The can promises um, something with oats and wheat to sort of flesh it out. Small oats and wheat unite for a smoother ride, full flavour, no alcohol, all New England. Full flavour. There is some flavour to it. Um, it's more like a cordial, but then because of the body and the the, the 0.5% alcohol, I get that. Um, would I drink it if I was out? I'd have a Coke. I've not come across one alcohol-free beer yet that um, would um, I would drink on a night out if I was driving or anything like that. I'd rather just drink a soft drink, um, and, f and that goes into that as well. I just don't, I don't see the point. Um, I've had this conversation with with Dean and, and other people that I just don't see the point of them. Um, they're trying, and they are getting better. I mean, when you go back to oh, what was that thing from the Calibre, fucking Calibre. I mean, Jesus Christ! So they are getting better, and they are there. There is some taste coming through in them, but it's it's still a market that that fails for me. Um, personal opinion. Um, for me, that's a thumbs down. Um, I don't like it. It's um, bloody light. I mean, um, yeah, it's just there's nothing to it. It's. Yeah, it's not for me. Thumbs down. Um, so, yeah, comment down below what you think. Have you tried them? What do you think of alcohol-free beers? Um, interested, always interested in comments. Try to reply as many as we can. Um, hopefully we'll have Wanda back soon. Um, thumbs up. Give, smash the thumbs up. All the thumbs down. It doesn't matter. The interaction's good. Um, if you hate me and want me to piss off, then just write that as well. It's absolutely fine. Um, and... Find us on Instagram, Wonder Be Wonder, Facebook, Wonder Be Wonder, um, and I'll see you next time.